Whittier Regional Vocational Technical High School, commonly known as Whittier Tech, was founded in 1972. Located in Haverhill, MA, the school currently serves about 1,400 students, with a 12 to 1 student-teacher ratio. It serves many surrounding cities and towns primarily in the northern section of Essex County, accepting students from Haverhill, Newburyport, Newbury, West Newbury, Rowley, Amesbury, Merrimack, Georgetown, Groveland, Ipswich, Salisbury, Lawrence and Methuen. The school was named in honor of local resident, Quaker poet, and slavery abolitionist John Greenleaf Whittier. Topic academic program Whittier's academic program is designed and offers students a broad base in fundamental skills through its core curriculum in English, Math, Science and Technology, Social Studies, World Languages, Physical Education, Health, and Elective Subjects and to afford students with varying abilities the opportunity to succeed. Courses are designed in a sequential format and are integrated with the vocational technical areas, wherever practicable and mutually beneficial. All academic courses offer advanced sections for students who desire to further their education. Moreover, a tech prep program is offered to 11th and 12th grade students which parallels the college prep program and provides students with the opportunity for college credit and or advanced college placement. <laughs> <laughs> Student activities Whittier Tech has an extensive number of student activities. They include the Key Club, SAD, Vocational Industrial Clubs of America, Skills USA VICA, Multicultural Club, Model United Nations, Performing Arts, FICI Club, Chess Club, a school newspaper, and student government. Another annual tradition Whittier Tech takes part in is the building and donation of a parade float for Haverhill, Massachusetts's annual Santa Claus Parade held every year on the Sunday before Thanksgiving Day. In the judging of the floats, it has become the norm for the impressive Whittier floats to win each year. Topic School Athletics Whittier Tech's athletic teams are nicknamed the Wildcats. The school's colors are maroon and gold. They are a member of the Commonwealth Athletic Conference. The Wildcat football team has recently won its first state championship title with a perfect 12 0 season. Also, they have sent two athletes to big name schools Jay Pena to Delaware and Nicholas Mazon to Stetson University for the sport of football. Justin Reyes of St. Thomas Aquinas College was named ECAC Basketball Rookie of the Year. Sports offered include football, cross country, cheerleading, track and field, volleyball, soccer, basketball, wrestling, baseball, lacrosse, and softball. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Vocational courses. Whittier Tech offers many different career training options Automotive training Autobody collision repair and exterior designing of automotive vehicles CAD – drafting Carpentry Child care Cosmetology Culinary Design and visual communications Electrical Electronics, Robotics Graphic Arts, Printing Health Occupations Nursing, Medical Training HVAC Machine Technology Machinists do it with precision Masonry Marketing Metal Fabrication Office Technology Microsoft Office Training Plumbing Pipe Laying Master Certificate 
Topic: Co-op. Whittier Tech offers a comprehensive service for cooperative programs, part-time and full-time employment. Cooperative Education is a trade-related work program designed to provide a learning, work experience in which eligible seniors and juniors are placed in jobs during shop week. On alternate weeks the students will return to school for their academic and related subjects. Seniors in good academic standing are eligible for co-op employment. Students selected for co-op will receive on-the-job training during their shop schedule along with compensation for services provided. Cooperative placement requires a formal agreement in concert with the school, department of labor, employer, and student employee. The shop instructor, vocational coordinator, and placement director will approve individual student eligibility. The Office of Cooperative Director supervises cooperative training. Students under 18 years of age must obtain a co-op permit to allow them to participate in certain hazardous occupations. Topic OSHA. Every shop at the school goes through a 10-hour OSHA training program. This program is free and is mandatory for co-op. The OSHA class is free of charge. Topic MCAS. Whittier's MCAS enrichment program has been developed to improve students' performance on the MCAS. Whittier states that they have assumed a proactive role in this endeavor and their goal is to work with students to develop the skills necessary for successful MCAS results. <laughs>